guys welcome back to my channel and welcome back to another video from me and my lovely friend and Wilma and where's Mr Lou? I don't know where Mr Lou is. How are we all? As you can see I'm surrounded by a lot of laundry because we're having a good old classic self-care sort your life out kind of day. I'm actually wearing a piece from my new Jim Jam the label edit gonna give you a haul in this vlog because I know that you guys over on the YouTube girl gang absolutely love a cozy pyjama and love a self-care day so that's what we're here for we've got a hair mask in what's new we've got the intense oil we've got the intense hair mask and we're just out here living you know this set is actually going to be in drop two which is coming soon so this actually hasn't came out yet um, but like I said, I will show you some of the pages. You have a big drink, babe. Don't worry about me. I'm going to do the same. So I've had a shower. I've put my hair mask in. I've fully moisturised my body. And I'm now, well, I have just organised... Sorry, let me prop you up. That's really quite frustrating. There we go. Um, I've just organised all my vitamins in my gorgeous little vitamin container which i just said on instagram makes me happier than it probably should brings me so much satisfaction it's not normal um but i've also just did a big order as well because i know it's not the start of the month but it kind of is it's the 11th right now um and i feel like i needed to stock up on some more bits i'm actually not feeling very well today if i'm being honest i have took a covid test um but it's negative but I'm just feeling really run down I was shivering this morning Jordan tried to wake me up and I literally was like not moving for anybody and that's not like me usually I get up quite early um so I'm feeling a bit run down and I thought you know what we're coming into winter where we're going to be starting to feel ill it's cold we need to look after ourselves so I've actually just ordered some of the defense shots which I showed you a few videos ago um because they're really good to just keep in the fridge i've ordered some multivitamin gummies which my sister has i got them for her last month um i'm gonna try them because she said they're really nice i have got some zinc and magnesium i take magnesium already um but zinc is meant to be good for like your immunity as well and then i've actually got some of the little snacks that my vitamin do so i'm excited to try those because they'll be good with my afternoon cup of tea when i always need a little sweet treat who can relate i'm actually pretty stocked up in terms of like my classics which i take every day regardless so the apple cider vinegar gummies i've got two boxes still in there with them i've got my that's apple cider vinegar as well i've got my gut gummies last time i showed these to you guys i was recently incorporating these into my vitamin routine i hadn't had them before 10 out of 10 recommend also when i posted these loads of you guys messaged me and said that you took them and that they were a game changer i absolutely love these i know i mentioned to you all that i had stomach issues ongoing unsure what they are i haven't had anything who's just pulled the oven glove off the chair what's going on today why is everyone being a bit silly i think wilmer and corby are a bit excited today um I haven't had any real stomach issues since taking these. I haven't been getting bloated. The only thing I've changed in my diet is this. Like, I haven't been eating, like, really healthy or cut anything out. So, please try these because 10 out of 10 recommend. Um, I've actually... I'm fully stocked up on biotin. I mean, look at that. I think there's, like, hundreds in there because I put a few containers into one to make it easier to store. Um, but, yeah, going to leave my code on screen gonna leave um the website linked down below as well i've stocked up use this opportunity to stock up as well my code gets you 55 percent off which is an incredible saving you all know i'm a my vitamin customer i have been for years so it's an honor to work with them on a regular basis now um but yeah oh i also got some new hair skin and nail gummies because again so good especially since i got my hair cut off i feel like i'm really trying to build up the thickness in it again um, I do have quite thick hair anyway, but I feel like I want it all to be super thick and blunt and just like glossy and gorgeous. Um, but yeah, leave those links down below for you all. And what am I doing now? I'm going to sit and do a little bit of work that I need to do, a couple of emails. The second load of laundry is nearly finished. Don't know where I'm going to hang it because, oh, 
God, I'm like a broken record, but drying your clothes in the winter is just not a vibe. It is just not a vibe. Oh, something fun actually for lunch today. I went and did a food shop yesterday. Um, for lunch, I'm making this TikTok salad. You know me, I'm a sucker for a TikTok trend. Just can't help myself. Um, get so easily sucked in by all these amazing recipes. So you may have seen the Green Goddess salad. I saw it everywhere a few months ago and then my friend Lucy actually recommended it and I was like, right, do you know what? I'm actually going to make that because it looks delicious and I'm quite bored of my chicken wraps that I have every single day. So let me show you what it looks like. That was so aggressive. I didn't need to put that girl eating that chip so close to the screen. Sorry. Let me get a photo of it. Okay, I've paused it so you can see, but this is what it looks like. It's got like cabbage cucumber it's very different for me but i feel like i'll really like it so i bought all the ingredients wow it had a lot of ingredients i had to get like a nutritional yeast and stuff which i've never cooked with before so unsure really what that is but you know it goes in the salad i'm gonna make a big batch of it for me and sophie for lunch maybe do some like grilled chicken or something on top because these people are having it with like tortilla chips like a little like Dorito situation, but I'm trying to be a healthy girl, so I don't really think I should whack open a bag of chili heat wave Doritos because you best believe I'll have to go and buy a sour cream and chive dip and eat the whole bag. And that's not for very self care queen, is it? Do you know what I mean? Um, but yeah, gonna do a little bit of work and then I'll pick you up when we are green goddess saladin. Okay, green goddess salad, let's go. I'm gonna leave the TikTok linked down below because that shows you all the ingredients um, and how to do it because I've missed out a few ingredients just because one, I couldn't find them, two, maybe I don't like them. Um, I just do my own rendition, okay? Um, but the base of it is a cabbage, which is weird because usually, obviously, I do use lettuce. Um, also, cucumber and chives. In one of them, I saw spring onion. In the other, I didn't. So, don't know if I'm going to use this. Um, and then the sauce has, like, shallots, um, lemon juice, spinach, garlic. You know the drill. I'm going to pop it on a time lapse. I'll show you the finished product. But if you want to see the recipe, I'll leave it down below.
here is the finished salad. What's your thoughts, sis? Very yummy. Very yummy. Sophie's having it for lunch. I'm having it for lunch. It's um, I think I need to cut this smaller. Um, but it was taking me ages and I couldn't be bothered. Um, but it tastes kind of like. It's kind of like tangy, but I think that could be because I put loads of lemon juice in. Mm. Um, but it is really crunchy and delicious, and I guess you could put it with chicken. It tastes but... a bit like coleslaw. Yes, it Isn't does, because of the cabbage. It's like crunchy. Mm -hmm. um, so, yeah, I'm going to have this for lunch. Um, I'm not that hungry, or I would have put like chicken or something with it, but I'm just going to have this. Okay, I'm going to show you some bits from my Jim Jam edit. Oh, Obviously, no. what? Are you recording? Yeah, bye. Take a hint. <laughs> oh god, man. Oh god. Right. So, Jim Jam haul. Obviously, this is part of it, but this is coming in drop two. I'll show you drop two when it launches. This is drop one, which launched yesterday i will leave the link down below so you can go and shop it if you see anything you like but let me just tell you some absolutely gorgeous pajamas and if you're starting your christmas shopping which to be fair i've thought about and thought probably should start soon some of these pajamas are such a good christmas gift so first up we've got these zebra pajamas i love the pattern of this i think these are so gorgeous on oh, all the pajamas have this like super thick waistband like thicker than your usual ones because i like to have mine high waisted cinch it in tuck in the front um and just be really really comfortable they're also wide leg and has this almost like panel detail on the wide leg which <clears throat> sorry about that which makes them look really expensive and luxury they're so gorgeous i wear everything in a size small medium for reference so that's the bottoms and then the matching top is your classic button up pajama top like this so these are like a really soft satin material really really lightweight really comfortable to wear and all of the pajamas you can personalise. Um, so I've obviously got a little DC on there. So if you do me a favour and just pick Wilma up because she's crying. Yeah, can I have my slippers back please? I need to go outside. Thanks. Oh, they were nice and warm. <laughs> <laughs> um, yeah, I love the personalised detail. You can do this on all the pieces. And like I say, it's such a lovely gift to get someone some personalised pajamas. Will Matt to join the haul. <laughs> Another pair of satin pajamas, these red ones. If these don't scream Christmas Eve pajamas, I don't know what does because these are absolutely gorgeous. Again, the embroidered initials is in the same colour, um, just to make it feel a little bit more classy and all one um tone i think it makes it look really expensive same with the piping we've kept that red because i think it looks really gorgeous really expensive and this comes with again the matching wide leg bottoms you can really see the waistband there it's really thick really stretchy really comfortable and then we've got the little drawstring if you want to cinch them in and make them a little bit tighter um again the big wide panel at the bottom making them look very luxurious these would be such a lovely christmas gift for someone i love them um should we stick with the satin ones first yeah okay i think these could potentially be my faves i mean i love it all but i just think these when i saw the photos of these they look like they should be like a designer like i think they just look so so gorge um so we've got this pinstripe blue it's like a navy kind of like a little bit lighter than navy colour again in that lightweight satin material it's got a gorgeous square pocket at the front and your initials engraved in it the buttons are a lovely little blue satin material so it all flows gorgeous together these are just so so cute matching trousers of course the same as the rest we've got the thick panel at the bottom we've got the thick waistband and we've got the drawstrings as well 
gorge. Pajamas are just like my favourite thing in the world to wear. Like I'm one of those people who gets in the house and puts pajamas on straight away or I love having a shower and a pamper and putting fresh pajamas on. Like that is just my favourite thing. So the fact that I've got all these gorgeous pajamas is making me so 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 happy. Um so we've then got these classic white ones. So these are actually in um more of like a jersey cotton material if you can see there. Look how stretchy this is. The only way I can compare this quality is if you've tried the Skims pajamas. These are literally like that. Like they're really really heavy. They're really thick. The quality is 10 out of 10. Um I've had like jersey pajamas like this before where they've been really thin. Um, and felt quite cheap. These feel so luxurious, I'm obsessed. Um, so the piping on these is kind of like a nudie mocha colour, same with your initials, which is such a lovely detail. And the trousers, all the exact same fit, um, but these are so comfortable on, they're so, so soft. So we've got the big waistband and the ties at the front. Again, the panel at the bottom with the mocha piping. These, honestly, I feel like if you're going to get anything, get these because they're like your classic pyjama. Um, but just really lovely, lovely quality. And they've got pockets on the bottoms as well. We've then got these gorgeous little satin shorts. So very similar style to the full length ones with the thick waistband, the panel at the bottom and the drawstring. They're all very matchy matchy. Um, but obviously these are short. It's like a striped champagne satin material. These would be gorgeous for the summer. And then the top, I'm so happy how this top turned out. So we went for a cowl neck um, little cami top. This is so flattering on. This is the type of top that I would actually even wear out um, because the cowl neck is gorgeous and it's really flattering. We've also got adjustable straps. So you can fit it to you, whether you want it looser, you want it higher neck. Um, and this looks gorgeous as a little set, especially when you tuck in the top, it looks like a little play suit. It is so cute. And I, of course, had to include a matching dressing gown. These are what I get ready in all the time. If I'm doing my makeup for a night out, if I'm getting ready on a morning, this is what I throw on. So this is matching to the cami and the shorts. The oversized bat wing, really, really flattering, really comfortable to wear dressing gown. And, of course, we've got the personalised detail on there as well. So, yeah, that is the collection. I'll leave it all linked down below. Let me know if you pick anything up. They are honestly the most gorgeous, quality, comfortable, amazing pages ever and it was so fun to actually design them from start to finish because as someone who literally loves pyjamas and wears them all the time, I feel like the fact I got to design my own little collection of my perfect pages is a dream. Um, but yeah, I'll leave them all linked down below. Hello from me, sat in the same position as I was at the start of this vlog, still surrounded by laundry. What is new? I'm just sat editing this video. It's actually Wednesday today, so I'm gonna... <coughs> this behavior is not acceptable. Um, I am just editing this video and realised that I didn't actually round it up. I'm in the middle of filming another video as we speak. Um, but yeah, I really hope you enjoyed this video. Make sure to like, comment and subscribe if you did. And I will see you in Sunday's video. Bye.